hello everyone welcome to my video in this video i will guide you how to install and enable hyper virtualization in windows 10 and 11 so let's not waste any more time and dive into the guide so as you know uh, hyper v is not included by default in the home edition so what we are going to do is open the task manager click on performance click on cpu here you need to check whether your virtualization is enabled or not if it is disabled then you need to enable it from your BIOS so you will need couple of requirements for that like 64 bit processor with second level uh, address translation SLAT supported and you're gonna need minimum of uh, 4 GB now come to the point of how we can install it come to your desktop and make a new uh, text document uh, which we're gonna name uh, hyper V open it up and paste the command i will put the command in the description you can directly copy and paste it now click on file option and save as whatever the name you like but set it as .bat you need to save it as bat format and click on uh, save now right click on that file and run as administrator now it will take 5 to 10 minutes in your computer at the end it will look something like this then you need to press y which means yes and then press enter then your computer will restart after rebooting just search for hyper v manager and to enable it you need to go to task window uh, features on and off now click on it here you can enable or disable it and click on ok then after restarting your hyper v will be disabled or enabled whichever you have selected at that time so that's how you can install and enable hyper virtualization in your windows i hope you find this video helpful that's it for today thank you for watching